Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com and now that we've actually have the Android 2.1 update on our Motorola Droid, let's take a look at exactly what we got. As you can see, the app drawer is still the same app drawer. Sorry you didn't get the cool 3D one that's on the Nexus One. Live with it. Let's just dive into the settings and make sure we know exactly what we have from where version 2.1-update1. That's it. That's what you're looking for. Now let's take a look at the big changes we have. Um, pinch to zoom actually in Google Maps isn't that new. We got that in a market update earlier, but it's back and it's still there, so cool. And we also have pinch to zoom in the browser. I went ahead and pulled up CNN because you can actually do pinch to zoom here. And also just so you're aware, no flash. Sorry, we're still waiting on that. When you first launch the browser for the very first time after doing the update, you'll be at google.com and that doesn't actually have pinch to zoom enabled on it. Just on the site, it's the mobile version, whatever. So don't freak out when you open that up and you can't pinch on the basic little search bar. Now, we shall take a look at the gallery. We have pinch to zoom here. You can't actually pinch to zoom in this giant overall gallery view. As you can see here. However, once you choose a photo, you can pinch to zoom to get closer and zoom away. Whee! A lot of fun. That's cool. Whatever. Oh, what else do we have? Let's see. We we'll only have three home screens. We didn't get five like the Nexus One. Didn't get nine. There's rumors out there that we're getting nine. Don't worry about it. You do have a new widget to play with. A lot of people have asked about the weather and a news widget that's on the Nexus One. Well, here it is on the Droid now. It's part of this ROM. It's part of Android 2.1. You can choose weather, you can choose news, or you can choose both. I like both, so we'll put that up there. If you hit the uh, little sunshine, little weather thing, you'll get taken to weather, and then you swipe left and right through the different news views. It's kind of cool. Very simple. Nicely done. Now let's take a look at the wallpapers. That's the other big thing. We have live wallpapers. Yay! You got the big selection that you also have in the Nexus one. Also, there's the very cool one if you haven't seen already in the new version of Google Maps. You can make that your live wallpaper. So we'll set it. You can't actually zoom in and out when it's on your desktop, when it's on your home screen like that, see? But you can, however, view it on all of your home screens, and that's very cool. And it'll follow you around. If you're traveling, it'll follow you as you move. Pretty sweet. Let's take a look at the other ones. Galaxy Grass, Polar Clock, I like that. Neural Network, that's kind of the uh, the stock Nexus One home screen, uh, live wallpaper, but they've recolored it for the droid, so you got the droid red and blah, blah, blah. And remember, it reacts to your touch, so if you touch it, there you go. Very cool. I like it. All right, everybody. think that's going to do it. Hope you enjoy the update. See ya.